<gasps> Bullseye. Hey, I'm pretty good at this. Excuse me, can we talk about this? Th that's right. Just talk it over. Mm -hmm. <laughs> huh? <gasps> <gasps> Why don't you take your best shot? If you can pull the trigger, that is. I found it. My new objective. <laughs> hey, sailor <laughs> uniform. <gasps> when you aimed, you aimed at me, right? A damn good shot. However, you're too kind. In fact, it's sort of touching to see someone as kind as you. In a world like this. <gasps> what do? It's too bad, though. Even if you're nice, I still have to kill you. <gasps> the reason being, that helicopter only has room for one of us to escape. Kindness isn't gonna get you anywhere in this world. It's just human against human in this death match. Was I wrong? Rika, what should I do? Do I really have to kill this girl? But... I can't... Huh? Please stop this! There's no way I can fight in a death match. I can't do it. What are you Please, crying I... for? Look at your weapon. You're clearly at an advantage with that gun. All right, fine. Why don't you and I just call it off for now? <laughs> well, it's obvious. You're not exactly eager to be escaping from this world, are you? You see, when humans need to, they can easily take the life of another. Just like I'm able to. She might actually be right about that. It's not that she lost her mind. It's the opposite. She's incredibly calm. And what she said about me is true. My main goal is to find my brother. I couldn't possibly escape from this world and leave him behind. But... Hey, do you think you can make this quick? The helicopter on the roof won't wait forever. A death match between humans. If those are the rules of this world, then... The last thing I'm going to do is follow them. Very well. I'm going to let you go. For... Down to rapid fire. I'm in a much better position. If Sniper Mask's only weapon is that rifle, I can win. She just risked her life to cover me. Unbelievable. And right after I tried to kill her. Also, listen, if we can just kill him here, things will be easier later, okay? She was crying until a moment ago, but when the mask appeared, her eyes changed. So she's making her stand here. Hey, huh? Tell me what your name is. Mine is Yuri Honjo. <laughs> I'm a uh, Mayuko Nisei. is too dangerous. This I should just bad. leave this girl and make my way to the helicopter. <sighs> Ever since I was young, I've been surrounded by enemies, my parents included. That may be the reason I was able to adapt to a death match between humans so quickly. I won't deny that I've killed humans and masks alike using any means that were available to me. Those are just the rules of this world. And the rules are justice itself. <sighs> Yuri Hanjo. She's the only one who's wrong here, not me. Anyone stupid enough to hold on to their kindness in this world has signed their own death warrant. <clears throat> uh, we should head upstairs for now. I think I have an idea. Uh, but, but even if I go up with you, the helicopter only seats one person. It's fine. So I have an ace up my sleeve, all right? I'm gonna use it now for your sake. That 
put an end to him. I'm sure of it. The sniper mask. I think he's gone. Was he blown out the window? Thanks for that. Hmm? It's just, that was your last weapon, right? And you decided to use it to help me. Well, the only reason I did it was because you saved me earlier. <laughs> <laughs> I knew shooting you wasn't the right thing to do. Even though you may be a murderer, you don't seem like a bad person, Mayu. This girl's face is a revolving door of expressions. But where does she get off calling me a nickname? So anyway, what about the helicopter? You're gonna let me take it, aren't you? Hmm? Yuri? <clears throat> hey! Yuri! Rika... Yuri, are you listening? Yes! So the helicopter then? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's all yours, Mayu. One thing. If you really do make it back to the former world... Here. Hmm? Will you give this to my parents? I want you to tell them that my brother and I are stuck in this bizarre world. You said brother? So you have a sibling here too? Mm -hmm. Which is why no matter what happens, I have to go find him. Once I do, we'll return home. Oh, so that's your deal. I get it. You can do it. Hmm. So this is goodbye. Hey, Yuri. I'm not gonna forget about you. I promise. I'm not going to kill any humans. I refuse to follow this world's rules. I'll stubbornly break through on my own terms, and when I do, I'll return home with my brother. <gasps> hey, Mayu, wait! Do you have a cell phone with you? Mm. Shh. Do you hear that weird noise? Hey, isn't that noise the... It can't be. The, the helicopter? helicopter? But the sun hasn't set yet! All right, we have to hurry! <laughs> the rules work in this world. No getting around it. Disobeying them isn't allowed. Uh, hey, wait! Uh, you're turning around! That can't be. There's no way. You see? Look at that, Mayu. Now you can ride the helicopter. Automatic rifle? Are they angry? No, oh, no! Yuri! Run! I'm sorry. I ruined everything. Look, it's like I said before. I'm the one who chose to stick around. So, I guess I'll just keep living in this world until the next pickup happens. Besides... Maybe I wanted this. Maybe I didn't truly desire to go back to the former world either. I mean, if I returned... Huh? Hold on, Yuri! Are you listening? The helicopter... I think that it's this world's weak point. Huh? My brother once told me that when your opponent is desperate, that's when you'll find their weak point. That mask, his weapon, his attitude... There's no doubt he was desperate. 
The ones who are putting us through these trials in this world. They couldn't stand to have that helicopter stolen. That's true. I bet you're right. Then I found my objective. Obviously, I'll reunite with my brother. But I'll need someone to fly the helicopter, and people who can fight. I'll need allies. <laughs> Once I do, we'll take that helicopter. We'll take the sky itself. If we pull it off, we may just be able to crush it. Crush this joke of a world. <laughs> She's so ambitious. Take the sky itself? That's far beyond disobeying. It's an invasion. A high-rise invasion. Are you okay? Hey! Answer me, Yuri! Hey! Hey! Let's see which one of us will live the cooler way of life. My memories are still being controlled by the mask. I don't know what it was. I'm sure there was something I was supposed to be doing. Like bullets, well, at least I'll have fun. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Looking back, this may have all started because of that thing I saw when I was at school. Huh? What is that? It was a tower much taller than the sky tree. It was like it was reaching to the heavens. I saw it in the former world. Then, before I knew it, I'd come to this ridiculous world. How does that add up? This really is crazy. the dead girl downstairs still better than being barefoot though the gun is gone i wonder if mayu took it in exchange for the boots how awful of her and after we'd finally become friends no she didn't do anything wrong it's not like mayu ever said we were friends everyone's just watching out for themselves here now i'm alone again right now. Huh? Is he saving her? There's come 
camaraderie among masks? What? <laughs> no, the masks don't care about each other at all. I've already fired a total of five shots with this gun. There's only one shot left. I should kill this guy here and now. I'm not going to miss! Huh? That's right. Rika told me about this before. He said that police guns aren't made very reliably. I forgot! Stay calm. Stay calm. What's my next move after crossing the bridge? Think! Yuri? Sorry if I end up hitting you. If you what? I'm a pretty poor shot with this. <laughs> it's empty. <laughs> Stay back! <laughs> magazine in my pocket. That's why she passed me the gun. That just goes to show, I'll find no shortage of allies in this world. Hey, Mayu. Uh, that... Hold on. He's still breathing. You're never supposed to look at the back of a mask! Hey, what are you doing, Yuri? Uh, it's just that there's something I wanted to ask him. Uh, hey, girl, I can see your panties. Uh, 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 tell me about the mask. Tell me what happens if you see the inside of one. Uh, the moment you look, it's like you're instantly living in a dream. Try to disobey and you'll just end up following the commands. Yeah, but... Won't you return to normal if you take it off? It isn't possible. The brainwashing, or rather the brain hacking, if you can call it that. It won't allow you to return. Then, the one who's giving the commands, what goal could they possibly- This world is